Jenna here. Welcome to my channel. So summer is coming. It is June 2022. Um, a lot of people asking me what I eat uh, throughout the day, how I stay fit, how I stay healthy. So I decided to make this video because I feel like summer is one of the seasons that is the hardest to stay on track. Um, and there are three things that are so important for you um, and for me and for everybody, uh, you know, to make sure that you're fueling your body properly um, and giving it the nutrition it deserves. Um, and number one is, of course, what you eat. No matter what you do, if you exercise or not, if you're like working out here with me, if you don't eat well, not much is gonna change. And one of the hardest things to do in the summer is to stay on track and eat well because you have all the parties and the barbecues and all the chips and all the hot dogs. Um, it's kind of hard sometimes and tricky uh, to stay on track. So meal planning, definitely a good thing to do. Try to look at your calendar, at least for that week ahead. Uh, know where you're going, where you should be eating, um, you know, wherever you're going. And here, for instance, at my house, I have an almost three-year-old and a five-year-old. Um, of course, when you go to parties, all they want to eat is the junk that we usually don't have at the house. So what I do is, in terms of meal prepping, I try to give them meals at our house that are full of nutrition, so I'm not that annoyed if they're eating bad when they're out. Does that make sense? Now, if you don't have the time to go to the food store, pick out your whole foods, and then come bring them home and cook them, or you're just not into meal prepping, or you're just not into cooking, or you just don't have the time, it doesn't matter. I do uh, suggest you to look into Factor 75. Factor 75 is a food delivery service that delivers 100% cooked meals for you at your door. Their menus are updated weekly, so you're never gonna be eating the same thing all the time. Uh, they do offer keto, they have meat meals, they have seafood meals, they have plant-based. I don't know if you know, but I, consider myself a pescetarian uh, for the past, I would say, three years. I don't really eat meat. So I'm really happy that I found a delivery service, that they have that option for me. Uh, my husband eats meat, so that week that I'm you know, picking my menu, I can also mix and match. Uh, if you're having a busy week, I can make sure that he's eating his meat and he's happy. And same thing with me. I just wanna show you my personal favorite one from all the uh, meals from Factor 75 that I've had tried and is the garlic tomato shrimp if you guys can see it look at the size of the shrimp they're huge they're perfectly cooked and the flavor is amazing amazing it comes with the um, little saucy kale and look at that nice broccoli mm. so good but again the shrimp is to die for so if you're gonna order yours and you like shrimp make sure to add this to your box mm. so good does that make you hungry I am hungry. All their food are put together by dietitians, so you're getting uh, really good nutrition on them. The other thing that they offer, uh, smoothies that you can add to your box, they are 100% plant-based, zero added sugars. This one is strawberry banana, this one is tropical fruit smoothie, uh, really good for the morning. Sometimes I teach or I'm taking classes and I don't really like to have a heavy meal before, like heavy breakfast, so these come in handy. Another very important thing that I just wanna point out about uh, Factor 75 is that once you uh, choose your meal plan, you also have included with the service a 20 minute consultation with a dietitian. So even if you're not really sure exactly what you're gonna get, you know, you have your goals, what would be a best fit for you, you have a consultation with a dietitian. And that's really neat. I haven't really seen that uh, with any other meal delivery 
uh, program. So um, just on a side note, because I am a mom um, and I work from home, um, these are also great for you if you like had a baby, you know, and just cooking, spending time, like hours in the kitchen is like a absolutely insane and impossible for you. Uh, that's a really good uh, delivery service that you should be looking at. So you're making sure that you're eating well to feed your baby and for breastfeeding, but at least like, you know, you have the energy. Um, Cause it takes a lot to have babies and newborns. So factor 75 for the win here. All right, so we talked about meals and eating well. Uh, the next thing that I want to point out that is very important and I need to tell that to myself because once I was pregnant with Lily, which is my almost three-year-old little girl, um, I could not drink water. I would gag, that made me sick, which was the weirdest thing because you need water more than ever when you're pregnant, uh, but for some reason it just wouldn't go down and um, I needed to drink water. So I don't know if you know, but the basic rule is you need to drink half of your weight in water. For instance, I weigh 110 pounds, so divided by two is 55. So I need to drink every day minimum 55 ounces of water. Uh, there are two cups that I gonna tell you again if this summer you need to stay hydrated right more than ever because you're in the sun and you're out so two cups that I absolutely love I've talked about this one before and I also love this I'm gonna tell you what's the difference and why I recommend them first they carry a lot of water if you're carrying around a tiny little water bottle you might run out and then you're gonna forget and need to drink or you're not gonna have a place to refill your water bottle but anyway so this one is by Yeti I love this one. I actually got as a gift from a friend. I got this leaf um, afterwards. I am gonna link it below, but it's a Yeti and I mean, I live in Florida. Take this around. It's the best thing ever because it keeps your water cool. I just put a little bit of ice and it literally stays here for hours upon hours. Um, at home, if you're gonna stay at home, it doesn't make a difference. I do not love plastic, but this bottle is amazing because it has the time and how much water, you know, kind of helps you through drinking water throughout the day. Um, if you haven't seen this before, you can find them on Amazon. I'm gonna also link below. So um, this one, for instance, is 64 ounces of water. Um, if I have one of these every day, it's perfect. You know, that's what you should be drinking. And uh, this one, I forgot how many ounces, but we're pretty close. So I try to do this and a little bit more. Bring to the beach with you, bring to your parties. Don't forget to drink your water. It's so, so, so important for you. So that's my tip number two. Of course, next, what could it be? Exercise. Um, and I wanted to, of course, like you know that I exercise, because that's what my channel is, right? I exercise and I dance and I record my videos. I'm really hoping that you're working out with me from wherever you are. But, um, and this one is gonna be quick. When I talk about exercising, try to find something that makes you happy. Dancing makes me happy, and that's why I keep doing it. Um, I am not into spinning, for instance, but a lot of people love spinning. Um, I am not into running, which I'm kind of considering trying just you know, as a challenge, but running is not my thing, so I don't run. I love weight classes. I like to take classes. I can never like just go in the gym and like go work out by myself. I don't have that willpower, if that makes sense. I like to be in a group setting, music loud, it's loud, somebody's telling you what to do. Um, so that works for me. So when I talk about exercising, it's not specifically what exercise, but just find something that you love, that makes you happy and stick with it. That's the most important thing, that you stick with it. So if it's running, just make sure you clear out some time in your calendar and run. If you love dancing, but just find time, find a place and dance. If you like to spin, spin. Just do something that you love, that you're happy, it's good for your soul, it's good for your body, it's good for your mind. Exercise, just it can truly change, change your life. And um, so 
I feel like that's it. Like there's not much to say, but exercise, exercise. Find something that makes you happy. So if you are able to eat well, you know, balanced meals, drink all your water, and exercise, um, I'm telling you, not only your summer, but your whole life can be so much better. And I truly hope you strive for these. We all deserve feeling the fullest and just feeling good with ourselves. All right, guys. Mwah. Thank you so much for watching this. I hope this makes sense. If you have any questions regarding Factor 75, the water bottles that I have, meal prepping, um, and even my classes, if you have any song requests, just let me know. And again, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and make sure to check all the links for the good stuff that I we talked about here. All right? Bye. You made me